Hi everybody, Cynthia here. Before I get started in my craft room today, I decided to get back in my kitchen and do some cooking. My hubby has been super hungry for my tuna macaroni salad and I told him I would make it for him today. So, tuna macaroni salad is basically how you would make your tuna salad that you would put on bread or you would put on a hoagie roll and instead of that you're going to have it in pasta. It's super yummy, one of my family's favorites. So, let's get started. Okay, so in my bowl here, I have 12 ounces or one box of the bow tie noodles that are already cooked, drained, and I put them in the refrigerator for about 10 minutes just to get a little cool because if you add mayonnaise or your dressing to warm noodles and you go to put it in your refrigerator to cool, a lot of times the warm noodles will absorb too much of your dressing and then you're going to have to go back in and add more and more because it's dried out. So for right now, those are cooled and you may have to add more dressing later um, depending on how much your noodles absorbed. It's all personal preference. But I'm going to start out with a cup of mayonnaise and I will post the recipe below. And then I have two cans of tuna fish and packed in water and I have that drained as well. You're going to want to add two cans of it into the here. going to spread that out a little bit so I can get the rest of my ingredients in. All right, I have a half a cup of finely chopped celery, a half cup of finely chopped red bell pepper. I like the red because I love the flavor and I love adding the color. I also have um, my hamburger dill pickles. Now if you have fresh dill that would be amazing in this as well but my husband and I love dill pickles in our tuna so oh, I don't have a half cup I'm sorry I have an eighth of a cup of finely chopped dill pickles and then I have an eighth of a cup of these banana pepper rings that I finely chopped up and I use mild banana pepper rings. I only ever find mild, so I'm not sure if they have, uh, you know, different mild, you know, if they have a stronger um, flavor to them, but I only ever see mild. And then if you have fresh parsley, that would be amazing to put in this, but I only have dried parsley available to me. So I'm going to add a half tablespoon of dried parsley and also a half teaspoon of black pepper. You can pepper and salt and season this however you like. It's all salt and pepper to taste. Um, I don't add salt to mine because I kind of feel like the tuna and, you know, the bell peppers are the banana peppers and the dill pickles have enough. I'm dropping this all over my nice clean counter. Um, I think it has enough. Let me mix this with a fork first because um, this spatula is not working very well. I feel it has enough sodium in it that I don't need to go and add more salt to it. But like I said, you guys are going to want to salt and pepper years to taste. And it's just going to mix it really well. This takes a little while to mix it so that everything is distributed evenly. And I'm making a mess with mine. 
do you guys make a mess with yours when you're mixing stuff? Do you get it on your counter? Am I the only one? I don't think so. <laughs> oh gosh, I watch all these cooking videos sometimes and I'm like, wow, they're so perfect. And I make mine and I'm making a mess. And But that's okay. It's real. You know, it's just me. The scrappy bookworm. I love to craft. I love to cook. I love to bake. And I'm just trying to share my crafty life with you. Oh gosh, this looks so yummy, guys. I am going to put this in a covered container. And I'm going to let it get nice and cold. And then when my hubby comes home, we are going to have ourselves a little taste test. But this is one of his favorites. This would be perfect to take to your picnics and barbecues. It's something different, especially for those that love tuna salad. And it's not your average everyday macaroni salad. <laughs> um, it's really, really good, guys. Okay, I think that's mixed really well. Let me just rinse my hands off here because I have made a mess. And you know what? I think I'm going to taste test this myself. Get a noodle and a pepper. Mmm. So good, guys. Let me just give it a mix with this. Okay. I'm going to put it in my can container, cover it up, and then we're going to see what it looks like after it's been refrigerated for a while and see if we need to add a little bit more mayonnaise, but honestly, I don't think we will. It tastes so good, but we're going to let hubby be the judge of that when he comes home. I will be back to share that with you. Hi, everybody. We are back, and the tuna... Um, macaroni salad's been cooling for a few hours in the refrigerator, and I stirred it all up. You may need to add a little bit of mayo. That's You use your judgment when you taste it. We didn't add any more to ours, but my hubby did add his favorite black pepper. I said he was going to add more. So, okay, hon, give it a try. delicious <laughs> you like it I love this you know that okay guys give it a try let us know what you think and thank you guys so much for watching we're gonna sit down and eat our tuna macaroni you guys take care any questions let me know and happy cooking